Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Gain One, Stand With Knights. Dave Prezak here on commentary. I will be joined shortly by Veda Scott. A handful of competitors here on the undercard who are a part of this afternoon's world-class development seminar. Training, learning from veterans of the industry such as Sexy A Steel, Michael Elgin, Rosemary, and of course Kevin Harvey who's worn all the hats that there are to wear in the wrestling business from referee to wrestler, announcer, and promoting. But right now getting things started, two of the standout competitors from this afternoon's seminar, Jackson Argos and Tyler Matrix and Veda Scott, welcome to game one. Hi Dave, I'm glad I got here just in time to catch the opening contest here. Uh, as you stated, there's been an all day seminar here at the Berwyn Eagles Club and both Jackson Argos and Tyler Matrix were standouts on that. That's how they got this match on game. So we're gonna see what they have here. This is a huge opportunity to show show themselves off to get more exposure. A lot of people are gonna have their eyes on this. There are representatives from several different independent companies uh, that were here today, both during the seminar and here to watch Gain One. Of course, anybody who steals the show are going to get further opportunities, not just here in Gain, or not just uh, perhaps in Rise or Shimmer for the female competitors, but perhaps getting booked on independent shows throughout the country, perhaps throughout the world. Right, and we've already seen that uh, with Rise and how some of the Rise roster members have found themselves on the Shimmer roster already for upcoming events. Oh, hold on. Chasing game right here. Jackson Argo's on the run. Gets back inside the ring. Oh! Outside. Nobody home on the elbow drop for Argos. Oh! oh. Slapped right across the face by Matrix. And Tyler Matrix had that come scouted. I know that uh, Kevin's going to make sure that Soraya Knight and Ricky Knight get a copy of tonight's show just in case they want to bring anybody over to, to England to compete for WAW. And for a while it looked like Jackson Argos might have been a step ahead. Oh, hold on here. And over in the corner. Oh! Matrix with a beautiful drop kick. Great elevation. What I was going to say, Dave, is that... At this point, though, it, you can't even tell, but Jackson Argos is only seven months into his wrestling wow. career. Wow. Doesn't so show. These missteps, though, might just be inexperienced. Seven months. He's a student of the Storm Academy. Oh. Kick a little bit low. Referee Lockport Joe Tippett in charge of the action here. Oh, Catches the feet this time. Whoa. Head scissors, oh. able to take Argos off his feet and out to the floor. I don't know if I've seen that before, Dave. Trying to regain his bearings a little bit. Maybe think about his strategy going forward here. All right. But yeah, there are wrestlers of varying different degrees of experience on tonight's card from beginners, if you will, just a few months in the business to several years in the industry. So we're going to see a little bit of everything on tonight's show. And Tyler Matrix obviously is the more experienced here. Wait a second. Oh! oh! But one step ahead of Matrix right there, Argos was able to pull that ring skirt in the way of that baseball slide drop kick attempt, and now just there's nowhere for him to go. One of the ultimate veteran moves, shades of fin Finley there by Jackson Argos. Six now, months in, and he's veteran move. Apparently, he's been studying some tape. Both men back inside now. Jackson five. Jackson five elbow. Two five elbows. You don't know if it'll be five. Can he get up after the fourth? Stop to what he has in mind. Roll out of the way, bro. Roll out of the way. Ah, come on. It was five. Five elbows, though, not good enough for a three count. Not yet. Nobody's gonna. I mean, it would take some really powerful elbows to put anyone down. I mean, there have count. been some exceptional elbows in professional wrestling. There have been. But these guys aren't in the movies. All right, that, that might be a choke. That is definitely a Looking choke. Looking like a choke. Get in there, LPJ. How good am I at wrestling, right? Crowd offering some commentary of their own. All the way across the ring now, Argos runs oh. right into the elbow. Matrix one step ahead that time. Big kick right to the chest. On the second rope now. Goes for the oh. cross body, nobody home. Big 
side slam. Going for a cover. No. Only two able to kick out. So it looked for a moment that Tyler Matrix was going to regain his momentum, but no, Jackson Argo is able to avoid that crossbody. Hit him with a huge side slam. It looks like he's going to be back in control now. You know, though Argos is so new to professional wrestling, the fact that he's had that guidance under Lance Storm previously gives him one hell of an edge. I mean, it's been the students to come out of Storm Wrestling Academy over the years right. have done really well for themselves. We'll see another one later tonight in Chelsea Green, yes. team of Fire and Nice. But I don't want to discredit Tyler Matrix at all. I talked to him in the back. He is also very well trained. He's an OVW student. He's a student of Michael Elgin. He's done his, he was here at the seminar all day. They're all students of Michael Elgin today. <laughs> and Ace Steel, one half of the famed Steel Domain Wrestling Academy in the Chicago area. It turned out competitors like CM Punk, Colt Cabana, and a host of others. I trained there too. Landing a couple of chops here. Matrix just lighting him up. Momentum off the rope, stuck to the clothesline attempt. And able to take him down, leaping clothesline that time. Getting a burst of adrenaline here. Argos backed into the corner, trying to pull himself up. Matrix charges in, gets elevated to the apron. Oh! Drilled him with that kick. I think he got all of that. Needs to capitalize here, maybe something off the top rope. I thought he might go for a cover, but no. Tyler Matrix, big crossbody. Now he nailed it. No! Oh, very, very close, nearly a three count. Finally hit that crossbody we saw him miss earlier tonight. He needs to stay on him here, don't give him too much time. And I would venture to guess that the crowd did not know either of these athletes at all before the I don't think so. Not, neither were advertised. I mean, only a handful of the competitors on tonight's show were actually announced in advance. But they've definitely... the standouts from the seminar that earned spots here on the undercard. Right, but they've definitely won over this crowd, although they've taken sides, clearly. Oh! oh! Huge oh. kick right to the back of the head. Matrix needs to go for the cover or f follow up again. Maybe something off the top. I don't second know. maneuver off the top. I don't know about this, Dave. I would have gone for a cover there. Well, he's got Argos on his back. But then again, this is an opportunity to impress. If you can do something. Talking to the referee, wait. his shoulder. Hold on. Well, he might be hurt. Telling the referee, holding his shoulder. Oh! oh! Takes away the balance of Matrix on the top rope. Just lured him into that trap. Oh, and he plants him face first. Jumping flatliner. He calls that the brainstorm. Could this be it? It is. Jackson Argo scores the victory. Here is your winner, Jackson.